Hello there, welcome to another video. Um, start off today by showing you this product which I've got upside down. It's uh, the Mini Smart Router. Um, it's a clever little device uh, which I bought for myself uh, to connect to my PS4 funnily enough because PlayStation had blocked my IP and uh, this was my answer to it. Now I know it doesn't seem like a sensible purchase but it's not just a router it's um, <coughs> sorry to apologize it's a VPN as well and it doesn't come with a VPN you have to provide your own um, which we'll get into in a bit now this particular one I was having a problem with my ISP they were hacked apparently which I found out not so long ago and that's why um, my IP was blocked so I bought this um, because it does many different little features which I want to show you some of um, I'm not going to uh, show you everything it does but you'll get the rough idea that um, settings wise you get um, what you get with it is you get this Ethernet cable charger but it's not a charger because I don't think it can work without power being plugged into it all the time um, and um, there's a few settings there which you need to see really okay. it's a VPN 300 watt Wi-Fi and compatible so now the device itself has um, this here changes the modes from security you've got a reset button uh, you just hold it down for about 10 seconds and it resets the whole thing back to a factory you've got a USB slot which I think is a brilliant little feature you can plug a USB in there and transfer files to it from um, wherever safely and securely and then you've got your LAN in and out um, this basically provides internet to this device and then the route, the, the, the VPN sends the different IP out obviously um, and I, I love these little fan holes here to keep it cool and it does stay cool I had I, I played on it for four hours non-stop didn't lose connection don't get me wrong not the fastest speed because obviously you're going for a VPN but I was able to play Red Dead Redemption with this and it worked brilliantly and I was hidden with a different VPN I didn't need to be hidden just needed to a different VPN and that's a different IP address sorry and that worked for me my issue is sorted now um, I can play with my own VPN but I'm still keeping this device because I think it's a brilliant little device and that's why I'm showing it today um, and then you get the little instruction manual of general setup uh, wireless internet and um, sort of everything here you can go through and obviously you've got it in Chinese as well there's a warranty as well which I didn't even notice three months warranty but still uh, it's a great little product and works brilliantly well I have to say um, absolutely stunning little product now we'll plug it in and see it light up but it probably won't light up the way you want it to because I've unplugged the Ethernet cables because I'm not using it through the Ethernet anymore but the good thing about this which I haven't mentioned is it's also a repeater now what that means is this will connect to your router wirelessly and send out another signal which is VPN protected so if you are going to a hotel or this is why it's a, this is actually a travel router um, so if you're going to a hotel and you don't want anyone to see what you're doing on their internet plug this in and connect to this um, as long as this is connected to their internet you're fine um, and at the same applies to your home address if you don't want to put a VPN on your own home address put this on you don't have to keep it plugged in you just plug it in when you want it as you can see it's not connecting because I've actually got it switched to um, Ethernet at the moment and because obviously like I said there's no Ethernet it's not repeating so I'm not connected 
but uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch over to the PC and show you the settings and how to set it up um, what it can do what it can't do but it really oh no sorry it connected straight even though it wasn't on the oh there you go well it's got connection now anyway so that's pretty clever it just switched over on its own or maybe not it's just turned off but anyway I, I can show you the repeating part anyway which is quite a sensible little thing and I like that so anyway Let's switch over to the PC now. Okay. And then we go to the settings. So you can see internet's connected through the cable. Uh, there's my router it's connected to and here's your other settings you can tether it now <coughs> um, this is the repeater options which is on obviously so it does work as a repeater as well so it'll auto scan and repeat uh, when it's not connected the way it's connected now um, so there is no issue there it's uh, a setting and I've also got a cable set up as well because for myself it's quite a simple and easier way of doing things um, but you also got tethering and you can add a USB modem to it I'm guessing that's what the slots for so lots of options so you've got your wireless which you can set to whatever you want uh, change your password like I did VPN there um, these are things that are connected like my MacBook uh, upgrade this would usually I'd probably set mine to auto um, it says 4 a.m. change that Whatever time is best for you, your firewall, which um, I don't know if that's set up automatically or something you have to do, but with the VPN settings, which I've already got, as you can see there, and set and running, you don't need to do any of that at all. Um, and then you've got. Uh, I'm not sure what these applications do. This one's a little bit beyond me. You have to go through your other. You've got lots of others. You've got time zone, admin, password. Um, there's lots of other settings here, as you can see. It does so many things. It's such a great little device. So I'm not tethering, but I am repeating and pretty good. All very clever. And I love the fact that you can just connect it to a Wi-Fi connection, which you do down here. Go to the repeating settings. It's very simple. I can disconnect it from mine. Click on this. Um, scan. It will scan for the Wi-Fi. And you simply just put in the Wi-Fi password and it connects to it. And the VPN's up and running. And you've got an instant connection ready to go. Not a problem. I hope that's uh, helped you make a decision. What I will do is I will leave a link to my this little router where you can get it from on eBay and I will also um, by the way all you actually have to do for the VPN um, is go down to VPN settings and go to client here now you do manage and you just click on here open it up and drag and drop your files over from your um, your VPN service which you do have to pay for you cannot do it for free now the one I use is private internet access I think it's one of the best ones on the market they're not only secure they are constantly upgrading and they're constantly good and they are very strong and they're cheap too they're not too bad I only pay 
like uh, six bucks a month. You can pay yearly, like thirty bucks, and it's cheaper that way. You only pay three bucks a month, I think. But I don't. I pay monthly. But there you go. So I will leave a link to it, private internet access in the description, and I will also leave a link to this little router or from eBay in the description as well. So in case you want it, you want to have a look at it, you want to read up on it. I just wanted to show an option for hiding your IP address. Um, for people that have the same problem I did, I just uh, connected this through the Ethernet from my PS4 and I was able to play online again um, with PlayStation who blocked my IP for some reason, which now has all been cleared up obviously, but uh, was a real pain. So anyway, there's uh, an option for you. I did try all the little tricks on YouTube by the way, before anyone sends a message on the bottom saying did you try this, did you try that, I tried everything to get myself back connected um, and nothing uh, even my ISP was completely annoying and didn't bother helping so anyway hope this helps and thank you for checking out my channel and my video please subscribe and uh, I will make some more videos as we go down the line so thank you